Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my June favorites. I know I haven't filmed a favorites video in a couple months because I have tried new products, but they weren't good enough to share with you guys and tell you that they were my favorite things this month. But these products, they have changed the way I do my makeup completely. They're my everyday products that I use. They're just consistent and just amazing. So I decided to share them with you guys. Um, ignore my two thumbs. I broke my nails in have a suit when I just went that's why I look a little bit more tan got a tan out there and I broke both of my thumbs it hurt very bad but the rest of my nails are long and I haven't had time to fix the thumbs so don't mind my nasty thumbs <laughs> I just finished filming a foundation review so I hope you guys enjoyed that video it will be up after this video so that's why I still have the same outfit on I just didn't want to change it is very hot and I just want to wear this romper and it's easy to put on. Anyways, let's get right into my favorites. The first favorite of mine has been this Clinique Moisture Surge. Holy crap. When I put this on my face, it has changed my face completely. It makes it so smooth. And you guys know that I have dry skin. And I was just in that heat in Havasu. It was 119. Bless you if you live in Arizona. I don't know how you do it, honestly. Because I complain over here and it's like 100, barely. Over there, 119? That's a new level of hot. I didn't think it could get that hot. But it was bad. Bad, bad, bad. Like, just bad. Everyone got sunburned. I put sunscreen on every two seconds my shoulders got so burnt now at least they're tan and they don't they don't um peel i don't normally peel i just got burnt and i couldn't wear straps so i still kind of just keep on light clothes because they're still sensitive besides that point this helped me rebalance my face because it was just so dry i did get a little burnt on my cheeks and this brought my face back to life and my cheeks are now smooth again and it's just this pink gel and it's just well, it looks pink here, but when you put it on, it's clear. It just feels so nice and soothing on the skin. It just hydrates and refreshes your skin so much. It's way better than a moisturizer, I feel like. I've been putting this on instead of putting like a cream moisturizer, and I love it. I put it on in the morning before I put makeup on and as well at night. My face wakes up and it's just still hydrated. Like It doesn't feel sticky. It just feels smooth and it dries pretty fast on the face and it just smooths your face so much. I love this thing, just bomb.com, I honestly do. The next item that also saved me on vacation was this Jack Black Intense Therapy Lip Balm, and this has SPF 25. This is the original one, which is the natural mint. My cousin actually gave me this because she doesn't like the mint, but she has the other flavors, flavors, other scents and stuff on the lip balm, and this saved me because I know I use my Vaseline, but for the weekend, I didn't want to bring that because it's Vaseline on the lips and my, my lips were just going to get fried in the sun. And I haven't had one that had SPF in it. This saved me so much. Like everyone was using my tube. Okay, my tube was full and in three days, it went down completely. Like that's how you know I liked it, that I even kept it in my bathing suit while I was in the water. I just kept it in there and everyone was like, what's the blue thing? Like you'll thank me when you're in the water and you need some SPF on your lips. This just feels amazing and I'm surprised my lips didn't get burnt. I know my best friend got a heat sore on her lips. She wasn't using this. She used her normal chapstick and I was like, I told you to use my SPF. She starts using it after she already gets the heat sore. This thing will save lives in the sun, especially in 119 weather. Yeah, this bomb, bomb. And if I'm saying it's bomb, more than my Vaseline, that will tell you something because I repurchased my Vaseline lip therapy so many times. But this one, this is in my cart currently in Sephora.com. I have it on my phone, the app. I am going to purchase more of these because this thing is bomb. And it's only $7.50 right now in Sephora, which I thought it was going to be more because it comes from Sephora. But $7.50 for this bomb lip balm, yeah, I'm going to buy it. The next thing is what I have on my face right now to set my under eyes. I've used it in quite a bit of videos. This is the Catrice Prime and Fine Mattifying Powder Waterproof Transparent. That's what it says. And I bought this because Kathleen Lights had a video of like her favorite Catrice products and her not so favorite ones. And she said she really liked it and she has dry skin. So I wanted to give it a try and this just feels amazing on the skin. I was using my RCMA and my Laura Mercier powders. My Laura Mercier was drying out my under eyes, 
way too much so I don't use it for my under eyes anymore. I, so I just set the rest of my face with it and the RCMA powder, I was just getting tired of it and this applies the perfect amount on your face and it does not dry it out. Even if it says mattifying, it does not. And it works so well on my face, it doesn't break up my foundation later on in the day. I mean concealer later on in the day and it doesn't cake up, it puts the perfect amount on because only a little bit of product comes out at a time when you are applying it. I like to apply it with my e.l.f. blush brush and I just grab some and I dab it on underneath and it works wonders. The next product is my Ulta Beauty Full Coverage Waterproof, I think, yes, Waterproof Liquid Concealer. This is in the color Light Warm. This thing, when it says it's full coverage, it is full coverage, no joke. It does not crease on me. I have it on as well right now. Lasts all day. I just honestly love this. The consistency is thicker because it's full coverage, but not as thick as the Tarte Shape Tape. I never reach for my Tarte Shape Tape anymore because it was just too thick on the skin and I didn't like it. It would just be cake up. Even if I used the least amount of product, I just wasn't loving it. So I rarely reach for it anymore. I think my sister uses it more than I do. I love this one. Thank you to Casey Holmes for mentioning it in one of her new like first impressions videos that she had. She used this and she said she loved it. So I wanted to try it. I honestly love this. The next is a trial size product and this is the Lights Camera Lashes from Tarte Mascara. I'm gonna go purchase the full size because this one works amazing. I don't know if you can tell, but it's on my lashes right now. And I don't have lashes on, I just have this product. I only applied once. It volumizes my lashes so well. I think I kind of like it better than the roller lashes one, I think it's called, that I used to rave about because I loved it. I think I love this one more, like, just so good, so freaking good. So yeah, I love this. I need to go buy the full size, like, ASAP. <laughs> The next product has been my go-to eyeshadow palette for quite a while since I hauled it and I showed you guys that I had it. It's the Dulce Colors Beige Browns. These colors are amazing. Like just, just so great. So I use this on the daily. I have it on now. When I get ready in my car to go to work, I bring this and all I need is literally this color. To, to set my eyelid. This color for my transition shade and then I put either this color or this color to add some dimension and I'm done. That's it. Today I have all of these on actually. I have this as my eyeliner. I have these two in my outer crease to give some dimension. This is my transition shade and I use this one to set my lid. And they're just so creamy. They melt in your fingers. Look how pigmented these colors are. Okay? Yeah insane and that is one swipe i just rolled around once and i put them on they are amazing so these are perfect for an everyday use that's why i use them literally every day i do not do my makeup without these i love them i might actually go buy the mauve ones because i love the brown so much and i love one of shade in there that's one of the mauve shades i just have to pick it up because these dose of color shadows are so impressive i did get them online at ulta.com the next product is a little bit trashed because I use it all the time and I have not actually reached for my Hoola bronzer because I've been using this bronzer to contour and I know that's a shock because I've done every single video a month ago, like every makeup look that I do on the daily, I use this one and I have not touched my Hoola bronzer. I know they have the bigger one with the cream contouring but I don't need cream contour ever so I just wanted to go for the mini version, the pro to go and I love it. Even these highlighters are amazing. I know I've mentioned them before in one of my videos that I love this palette when I hauled it because I've used it before and I still use it. And I love it, honestly, love it. The last product is skincare and it is the Glam Glow and this is the Youth Mud Treatment and it's black inside and it has like little seaweed, I think, or something green in there. And this I use as a spot treatment. I know you're not supposed to, but I even sleep with it and it helps my pimples go down like in a seconds. Not literally, okay. But it helps my pimples like be less red and less inflamed. See how I have that one pimple here that I complained about that wouldn't get covered? This sucker took it down. This is the mini version because I don't really use any other Glam Glow mask and I picked this one up because I knew I've used this in the past when my sister bought it to spot treat and I loved it so much so I just picked the mini version up because they do dry out and I don't use it all that often 
only when I do get pimples. So that's why I bought the mini version and I love this. I know you're not supposed to use it for a spot treatment, but if you ever do, the little one is 20 bucks and try it on your pimples. I know there's one for like acne or something because my cousin tries that one out, but I like this one for that. I don't know. It just works for me. And that is it for my favorites video. I hope you guys enjoyed these products. I have used all the time, daily. I know I mentioned most of them in videos and I just want to show you guys that I really, really do use them. Even if I use them in one video, I have used them all month and I love them. I will leave all the products that I mentioned down below so you guys can check them out if you'd like. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!